What's happening? Rise Up 44 here on Nelio Gaming. In this video, we're going to be checking out Grip on the PlayStation 4. Let's jump right in. Alright, we have Campaign, Single Player, Online, Split Screen, Garage, Game Info, Settings, and PlayStation Store. Let's go with uh, the Campaign. This is your first time playing Grip. Would you like a quick introduction? Yes. Getting a grip. Welcome to grip in this short primer to get you up to speed. Investing a few moments here will really help you later on. Press any button to proceed from this or any of the following prompts. Let's see if you can get off to a great start with boosted launch control by hitting the accelerator the exact moment the countdown ends on go. Ready? Let's go. Getting a grip. Hit the green energy pads just like this one ahead to give your vehicle a boost. Try it now. This is pretty awesome. Getting a grip. Now get a feel for the steering by trying to follow the other players. Note that it's more sensitive the slower you go. Play for a moment. How can I follow the other players if I'm in front? The other button too. Okay, X is a uh, jump of some sorts. Green pickup orbs like these ones ahead to give your vehicle an offensive or defensive capability. Okay. Oh, I missed them. Offensive or defensive. Interesting. Right, we have people on the track below us. Alright. Good work. You got a Raptor rapid fire gun. Weapon. Try using the gun against other players with L1. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Okay, nicely done. You can also sometimes use the rapid raptor to damage the scenery around you. Hit other pickup orb to collect the next pickup. You get a scorpion missile weapon. Try using the missile against another player with L1. Position yourself carefully to increase the chance of a good shot. Scorpion didn't hit. Try collecting another one. Good work. Like the Raptor, you can also sometimes use a Scorpion to damage the scenery. Got a painkiller shield device. Try using the painkiller to shield yourself against other players with L1. Painkiller for a short time protect you from attacks from the rear. You got the Firestorm Chemical Cocktail. Use the Firestorm to give yourself a massive speed boost. That looks sick. The graphics are great. Wow, pretty fast, huh? Careful with those corners when Firestorm is active. Often, pickups appear in the second slot on your HUD rather than the first. In this case, press R1 to use them. There will be many more pickups become available as you progress through the game. Okay, so these vehicles have very high downforce. Try a driving on the ceiling for a while to see how that feels. This is awesome. That's cool, there's a mid-ground too. Don't hesitate, you're not going to fall off so long as you're going fast enough. Get up on the ceiling and show us what you got. You got it. Hey, you got a grip, bronze PlayStation trophy. That's it for now, for this tutorial, but battle against the other players for a few minutes to get real good.
Oh. That was so close. That was awesome. I almost uh, went off the track, but... Dude, this is so sick! I really like this. I'm not a fan of gimmicky race games, but this is awesome. Look at that. How did I manage to pull that off? Alright, we got a boost to catch back up. Very cool. I like that there's like basically three different lanes on this uh, course. Alright, we have two right now. Death from above. Brown's PlayStation trophy. I should probably save the rear bumpers until you go through a row of uh, pickups. That would be the time that somebody would hit you with a missile. So I think that's it for the tutorial. How many laps are there? Position 204, lap 8. Maybe this is the last lap? Let's finish up lap, lap 8 and see what happens. We have a rear view mirror. I can't see it going past 10 laps. Oh, I just screwed up anyway. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so what do we do here? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's what? You hold the touchpad in it. I don't know what the heck that did. All right, so quit event. So that was the tutorial, which was pretty awesome. This game's cool. All right, so campaign. Garage. Choose your rod. Dominator. Primary color.
campaign continue. Get a grip. All right, let's go. I'm just gonna do a race or two and kind of get a feel for it. See if we can't get into at least in second place. A thing. Hey, round PlayStation trophy. You did a thing. Use the launch ability. Okay. Event two. racing some other cars this time. Ooh, this one's kind of wide open. Full contact. Oh, not good. Not good at all. Not a good start. Pushed him right into it. The sound is pretty good. Jesus, this is cool. I think what makes it so cool is it reminds me so much of just like those those cool like remote control cars we had when we were kids that did all this stuff. Stunt double, ground PlayStation trophy. Oh no! My wheels got stuck. I wish you got points for flips, or maybe you do not this for game mode. Third place, not good. Not good at all, I'm way behind. You know what, that's okay though, I'm just getting used to the tracks and how to play and stuff. It's all good. Oh my gosh, the camera was wonky there. I mean, I'm way behind everybody right now. Jesus. first there. No. Oh man, I almost hit the wall. 
That's gonna cost me. They're gonna catch up right here. Second. Oh my god, that was so close. At least I got second. That was close though. It's definitely cool. It's it's a cool concept. Items have been unlocked. All right, let's check them out. All right, we got decals. What are, what are we got here? They're locked. Okay, so. Right now. It's locked, obviously. Oh, and you can't even really see what it looks like. Ooh, you can see what this one looks like. Yeah, let's check that one out. Well, let me... I hope it's letting me use this red car. If it is, that's cool. Looks awesome. Oh, yeah, we are. Two laps. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> right off the bat, I tried going around them because I got a good start and it went right off the track. What a moron. Another good start, but I managed to weasel my way through. The steering is very precise. I mean, I can almost turn it down a little bit because it's it is. Whew, you tap it and it goes. All right, left on the D-pad shows the different information. Uh-oh, not good, not good, not good at all. Of course we're in third place. Just went off the track. Jeez, I didn't even see that. I just don't know these tracks yet. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I just don't know enough about the game or the tracks yet to really do anything but come in last. Plus, I'm not that great at racing games just to, uh, you know, full disclosure. I never really was great at racing games. I enjoy them. They're a blast. And for what this is, this is really fun. Um, oh, my gosh. Like a ping pong ball. That was brutal. I probably should have followed him. Coming after you, Vector. If I don't crash again. Oh boy. Oh boy, like, oh boy. Cannot stay on the track. Back to third place, of course. I deserve to be. I mean, I've gone off the track twice so far. And, uh, yeah, I don't deserve to be anywhere but last. That was close. I saw that the last second. Why did I totally missed it? Wow, we might actually not get last place.
probably will though. Most likely you will. Alright, second place again. I'll take it. I'll take it. Very cool. It's it's a it's a fun racing game. The problem is is the market is saturated with racing games. But I can definitely see a place for it. So that's working on the tutorial. Very cool. We got single player online split screen. I like that there's split screen and online. You know, a lot of games nowadays they don't do the they do either or. Let's see if uh let's see if the servers are populated yet. I know that review keys went out and the game does come out in just a few days, so create private game, quick match. Let's see. Classic race. Let's just go with whatever. Easy normal. Hard find. I don't know if we're gonna sync up on anybody. It's possible. But unlikely, because like I said, it comes out in just a few days. Oh wow, we got a race. We can spectate, that's cool. Definitely better than just sitting here. Oh, we just got hit. This guy's got a sick car. Look at this guy's car. That thing is badass. I want it. They know how to race. Look at them. This person knows how to race. Jeez, they have, they have not hit any walls. They are on it. Follow them. Oh, oh! Was lost in there for the first time. Very cool. If you know the tracks, you can escape from getting hit by missiles too. That, that's another cool feature. So part of the strategy is to destroy environmental hazards for your next time around the course. It's actually really cool. Reminds me of like Twisted Metal, but like just racing. And I did see there was an arena mode. I wonder what that's all about. That is sick. That's a cool bumper. speed man this guy's legit it kind of looks like the Batmobile a little bit without the top how many, how many laps is this race 
I mean, he's got 10 seconds less than everybody else in this race. All right, you know what? Instead of racing, we're actually, you know, we just spent some time watching a pretty cool race. We're actually going to end the video here. So that's where I'm going to end my first gameplay with a grip here on the PlayStation 4. I do appreciate you watching on Nelio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44 and at Nelio Gaming. And please consider subscribing to me here on Nelio Gaming. So I just want to let you guys know I was provided with a game key to check out Grip and create content to share with you guys here on Nelio Gaming. So a shout out to everybody over at Wired Productions. It's definitely an interesting racing game. You know, the market, like I said before, the market's a bit saturated with racing games. But there may be a place for a game like this. This kind of brings back memories of those wicked cool remote control cars that we had when we were kids uh, that flipped over and, and, you know, they they were good whether they were upside down or, you know, right side up, whatever. They were, they were still able to move. And it's just, it's different and it's cool. And I want to learn more about it. The online servers have some pretty cool unique features. You can spectate and watch the race that's going on while you're waiting to jump into a game. Um, that can definitely be helpful for making the time go by while you're waiting for a race. There's a lot to dive into. We just scratched the surface. I wanted to bring you this video and just introduce you to Grip and maybe show you something you didn't know about the game. Um, we're going to dive deeper into it for sure. Um, but yeah, that's it for this gameplay preview. Follow me on Twitter at RedZone44 and at Nelio Gaming. Again, click that like button, subscribe, all that jazz. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.